Black Friday sale is live on jujimufu.com and gripgenie.com. We only do one site-wide sale per year, and this is it. Save on all the new products we launched this year, including workout pajamas, new stretchy pants, grip tools, grippers, and ah, the world's strongest smelling salts. Sometimes when you feel your worst, you're actually at your best. Push yeah. The equipment in here is rotting. What are we filming today? Uh, we're going to specifically hone in on the, the deets of the behind the back deadlift here. Because I think that this is uh, one of the most beneficial movements that people aren't doing. And I don't know why, and I think it's because nobody's actually figured out the form of how to do it. But I think the most important thing with behind the behind the back deadlift is to basically do it opposite of how you would do like a conventional deadlift. You know what I'm saying? Yes. But back, hamstrings, you know what I'm saying? Behind the back, it's all cat back, tuck pelvis. Also, I got a Marcus Roll poster that we are gonna hang up. And yeah. Oh, yeah. So, He's got his favorite set. I've kind of noticed that throughout my journey around the world to find the best gym, it really requires one thing, and that's classic bodybuilding posters. Anytime I've been to a <laughs> gym with classic bodybuilding posters, it's always a good gym. It doesn't matter if it's this square footage, this messy, you know, oily cat on the bench. <laughs> oily cat? Medium, I didn't even see the cat. Medium chain triglyceride fur cover cat. Whoa, there's camouflage back here on this towel. <laughs> she loves it here. It feels better the more you don't do it. The more you don't do it. <laughs> Your back will feel so good once you stop doing this. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow, see that? See that? A little ballistic warm up. Yeah, I get all ballistic athletic movements. So, Lee Haney was a huge fan. Yeah. Did you shrug that? Yeah. From the behind. I don't even know if my foot's cut. <laughs> my foot got caught between these blades. It's like the high shrug. Yeah. You know, they did it. The, the Olympic lifters who did the yeah, high shrugs. Yeah. My butt's getting. How is your ass not getting the way of the shrugs? Your ass is pretty much. Well, no, hit hip thrust. Yeah. <laughs> Cat back, pack the chin, push the glutes. There you go. Okay. Who needs a kettlebell swing to get like that? I love this lift. Try to pull that sucker up as high as you can. I think it's my favorite lift in the world. I'm gonna try to do some high pulls real fast and then we'll get to it. Let's see. So I'm telling you, you could have voluptuously, you know, rotund muscles get in the way. Hands, ass, it's all body control. So it's like the that. athletic specimen. The more muscular you get, the harder this lift gets. True. It's all body control, body awareness, you know? Every time I see you, you get bigger. <laughs> He's like 304 pounds now. Like, not only bigger, but taller. <laughs> he gets taller every time I see him. How are you still growing vertically? Well, I think I'm elongating my spine with these lifts. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, just... yeah if, if everyone did this lift, chiropractors wouldn't exist. The world would be a much taller place. <laughs> <laughs> Zoom on the traps. I will give, oh, take whatever you get. Look. There we go. Okay, I'll zoom on this. Zoom. Zoom! Whoa! <laughs> Those are some athletic calves. Zeus yeah. calves. Yeah. Want to add some weight? Uh, do some jumps with it first. <laughs> <laughs> why would you, why would you jump up and wait when you can literally just jump with the weight okay, before sure. you jump up with weight? Jogging versus sprinting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that work? Jump! I literally have to leave the ground. Yeah, jump.
go. How does it not, like, if it, it, when, when you jump and you land, the bar comes back and hits your hamstring. That's where you're working your rear delts. Now, I wouldn't say it's a full body exercise, it's a full body experience. <laughs> well, I actually jumped up my stairs with one leg, okay? Because the jumping, for me, had the freaking surgically repaired tendon. Noted. Okay, this is the hardest thing for me. This is no power. So what I do, okay, is I'll freaking go to my steps, and I'll jump and step, right? Yeah. And I'll take a second, jump two steps. And I'll take a second, and I'll jump up another freaking flight of stairs. Yeah. <laughs> and then I'll jump up a whole flight of stairs. Sissy squat, you know what I mean? Yeah. This is chalk, not litter, right? Yeah, it's chalk. <laughs> okay, it's right next to the litter box. I had to make I sure. did this litter when I didn't have chalk. No, <laughs> it didn't work well. <laughs> didn't do much. It actually made my hands slimy. Could be feces in it. Oh, God. Then afterwards, I'm talking to the camera, and I'm like, scratching my face. <laughs> people are saying I could get like some sort of bacterial brain infection. Uh-huh. Have you ever heard of that? Cat? Oh, no, that's pretty hard Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was like, it leads to like insanity or some shit. I was like, terrible for life, but great for lifting. I was about to say, probably good for the gym. Yeah, going, going insane, cat bacteria on my brain. Whoa, dude, look at that. That's, that's trippy. You've been doing this lift for the first time in a decade for the yeah. last only three weeks? One week, dude. This looks like one week. This looks like a lifetime of work. Oh, yeah. You get the form down. Yeah. I think my biggest thing is falling forward on it. Yeah, yeah. The way you don't have to go on the balls of your feet. You drive through your heels, push the hips forward. Okay. Here? No, well, I mean, that's just a you know, stretch like hip flexors and quads up before you do the lift. Oh yeah. Yeah! There you go. Good. It is feeling better. When do you start using a belt? Uh, 600. <laughs> so yeah, you got some of these, you know what I'm saying? That's what these. There's some recovery work. Free activation. Well, uh, when I buy myself, I'll do a lot like this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Don't let us stop you. Yeah. 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 My biggest weakness right now is this. You know, so when I can do this kind of stuff, this is just rehab. I'm not supposed to see you. My form is bad. So yeah. You looking at me? Yeah. You said when we curl together. Yeah. It's like the best pump in the world. Yeah. There's something about you know being in unison. So I was like thinking tonight, if you deadlift and I pull up each time, like yeah, we're connected. It's like energy. My wife was doing this. Look at this thing. This is a girl. girl. Whoa. Oh that. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. She did some triceps. Triceps. Yeah. <laughs> but I was doing pull ups while she was doing that. Yeah. And there's something about. It. Stuff going up together. Is that like marriage counseling? <laughs> it's yeah, on the same page. Finally yeah. getting on the same page. Couples that wrap together, stay together. I don't know. Don't get upset together. Oh no. 
You're putting your weight size numbers inside and doing numbers outside. That doesn't matter. You know that's going to make a difference? No. Because of the little lip, might like space them up. Nah. Shirt? Sure? Yeah. About hit 900. <laughs> <laughs> It's at your own risk. I mean, that towel will put it from a week now. If I get pink eye from you could, yeah. That's one of those theories that some people say it's not good to train slow. You know, I'm training explosive, you know what I mean? Yeah. You train slow, your body's gonna be freaking slow, you know what I mean? Well, I've been training slow for a while to build muscle, and I think it might actually be hurting me now. You think so? Because I think it added muscle there for a bit, but now I feel like I'm a little bit more prone to injury. I'm not blaming my age, yeah, it's yeah, part yeah, of it, yeah, but yeah, I think yeah. I need to start moving back to the explosive shit. Yeah. Yeah. It's a full body stretching routine, you just one lift. Dude. You said people don't stretch. <clears throat> I agree, but I do. Yeah, so this, this counts. I've noticed your pattern of training since I started uh, following you and got to know you. Like, do like a four week thing with one lift. Yeah. You fuck nuts on it, and then you kind of go to something that's a little bit like it. And yeah. You just I'm trying to find a happy middle ground now. Yeah. Because I did that, but I was like, at the time, I was like, that's some You know what I mean? Yeah. But then I stopped doing that. I was like, oh, I'm really making gains now. Okay. <laughs> For serious, it's like three hours doing that. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I'm not gonna kid. No, I know you're not. Be, I'm I'm done, done it with you. It will be dark out. We're done. Yeah, then we'll move on to another list. <laughs> 45 minutes before I get my next warm up set. <laughs> The barefoot lifting crowd is having a heart attack right now. They want to tell me to put lifting shoes on. They're pencil next time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I would have put a barefoot shoe on when I could wear a pump. Yeah. <laughs> when I, can, I want my shoes to have as much of a pump as I do. I know. Def Cat is actually a great gym cat. I know. I bought a drum set 15 years ago and yeah. she would sit on the drums. <laughs> drums the loudest. I would have the giant ear muffs on. Yeah. Yeah, you can tell this is the most unused piece in here. Yeah. Not because of where it is, but because of how new it still looks. Yeah. So the straps. Yeah, and now, now the straps are holding the weight. Holding the weight anymore, so I will figure this out. You're on a half I just smell the cat piss and you're going to Whew. Yeah. Dude, I opened up your, your smelling salt and I took a big whiff and I'm like, that smells just like my garage. <laughs> like honestly, you're breathing ammonia and the whole Shit. time in here. Where do you think we make it? So the Sheik, they have like, I don't know, sponsored like Jay Cutler and Phil Heath or something. Phil is just greasy, 
voluminous, like so fucking gorged. And then there's Jay, got no pump, no oil. Just looks <laughs> horrible, dude. I'm not saying, I mean, obviously Jay Cutler's, you know, whatever, four time, whatever, Mr. Olympia or something like that. But man, they really fuck on that wow. picture. There you go, there's the comparison. I was oh my God. About. Look at that comparison. Oh. I mean, yeah. Can you see that? Yeah. Look at how blurry Jay looks. And then Phil's just like greasy, oiled up, <laughs> incredible pump. And the lighting. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's just like, listen, I mean, obviously it looks great, but when you're putting a guy side by side. Boom, there we go. Okay. Is this your knee, please? Yeah. You had to invent this. It's so low tech that they don't even sell them that way. You have to make them. I'm gonna wrap my, wrap my knees in knee wraps. Yeah, yeah. Try that out. Probably won't help though because if you wanna, you know what I mean? Yeah. You're not gonna have any kick. But you should try it. You don't wonder why your quads are so sore and all Sometimes when I think about like, I just try to look at the positives in life all the time. So for instance, when I was on the lake with the gators, it's like, fuck, like I, could, I could get a leg bitten or something. But then I was thinking like, I could set a world record for the one leg like, behind the back that lift or something. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. there's yeah. always an opportunity. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, it's an inspirational story. Man loses leg to gator and learns how to backflip on one leg, sets world record. Sure. I got this one. I mean, they did not help. Would this help? actually help? Let's ask the pro. Ask the, the pro. That's the pro. What's up? <laughs> this. Take that, push this. Push the hips, push them. Push them, yes. seen someone have rot rotted gym equipment. <laughs> like literally, the equipment in here is rotting. This is another level of rot. Like when this <laughs> actually rotting. Blood clot sleeves. Uh, they're not helping that much. No, oh, okay. Something though. Uh, I think it's the cold weather. You know what I mean? What the? It's not cold in here. That's for sweating. <laughs> Dude, I was thinking about putting a a scented candle in here for you. What? Just to make it. Smell. What would you? What would be the scent? Right. Well, it's kind of like lemon balm. I don't know. <laughs> to make it smell better in here for you. More like my wife at least told me to. Oh no. no. But I was like, well, I just kind of saw some article that that like is literally just like breathing in car exhaust. Lemon and yeah. cat piss at that point. Yeah, like a lemon, like a, yeah. <laughs> Plus it might be like a chemical reaction. 
with all the Folgers you have in your body, it's definitely a chemical reaction. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Got your uh, PR honey here. Well, I got some water because I realized I didn't have a single cup. I had 10 scoops. Actually, I probably had, let's say I had, I had 13 scoops of instant Folgers. Yeah, you made me a 13 and then I had scoop cup myself. I was serving a pre workout as well. I always forget how much stronger uh, the, a, a boobs prepared instant coffee is compared to basically anything else. <laughs> <laughs> I get 2,000 milligrams of caffeine in one go. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so this is the old beef jerky belt. Like, I know, I just wore that. Uh, that's, I, I, I that's where it. I got this from. Uh, I've seen it. You brought it to my gym years ago. Yeah. It still exists, huh? Oh, yes! There <laughs> for a moment in time. <laughs> yeah, it's got like mold on it. <laughs> well, well, that's not surprising. Yeah. Is really happy though. Yeah, cats yeah, never look more relaxed in their life. What can I do to help? You want me to stuff the cat litter box in your face for the ammonia, right? No, just, just look at me. Just look, look at me. Anything. Does that help? Just look. Don't don't even look at me though. Don't let me see you. Just step back and look. That's why you gotta warm up exactly like how you want to max up. Yeah. So I, I know how it sounds on the floor. If we change the sound, it might throw me off. You know? These are advanced techniques. It's probably old school techniques. <laughs> I just love how he says that he's changed shoes, belts, <laughs> straps. Yeah, that's throughout the entire <laughs> thing. He's saying it's like, like it should warm up the way you're gonna max out. Everything in here is wet. It's so hot. Can you see that, Nikki? <laughs> Whoa! You see that? You can write something there. See that? Yeah. Yeah. Hashtag. Hashtag. Yeah. I was gonna tic tac toe. So this is seven fifty five. Uh, two days ago I hit 785, but warming up to it, I did not do something. So this will be my first time in 755 in almost eight years. Okay. Wow. So this is groundbreaking stuff. Ah. <laughs> You know, I think the silver ones, I think those ones are a bit shorter. You want the silver ones? Yeah. These ones here. Alright. Those are like, the, those ones are like 47s. Dude, the condensation in here does not stop on those mirrors. The place in here are just like oiled up. I need to give you a devil check. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, I don't know. You got plenty of room in here for it. I know exactly where to go. It'll be right here. <laughs> <laughs> you have one cubic square inch or whatever. Are you using the same two and a halfs? Because I got a bunch of different ones. That's the idea. Let's keep them even Stevens here. I don't like mixing plates. Oh, yeah. the, the width's different, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. you're, you're, everything's offloaded. 
But it's not just the rust, it's literally the cat hair that's stuck to it. It rusted cat hair onto it. Like, that is the grossest towel. Like, <laughs> drying my skin off the head and touching my face. And just, I don't even know what this is. Look at that on camera. Yeah. You were just stepping on it a second ago. Oh, what wow. Is that? Um, that looks like shit. <laughs> what? Did you see that? I was wiping my face on that. I feel like just sitting here, I feel like I have cataracts in here. You know, like the clotting splots? Well, I fell asleep with my contacts in last night too, so all these fumes and <laughs> I was telling myself I gotta go to bed early last night. I need to be really fresh for this. Yeah. And then uh, I never saw it before, so I started breaking bad at 11 o'clock. And, <laughs> and it drew me in, so I didn't get to bed until very late. And, <laughs> Got no sleep, contacts crossed in my eyeballs, about 15 cups of Folgers. Yeah. That sounds like a PR day. Yeah, well, sometimes when you feel your worst, you're actually at your best. I know you know Lazarus AD. Yeah. You know what I mean? Ben and Dan, like, that was my beard. I did it. 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 I'm like, okay, that's, that wasn't it. I just use music. I don't use strength. I just use music. <laughs> you're just a, you're just a, uh, what is it? You're a vehicle. Yeah. For, 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 yeah, for the yeah. lift. Yes. Yeah, you're, you're not lifting it. You're just a, you're just a, it's kind of like ideas don't come to you. You just receive them. Yeah. You just receive the lift from the muses, from the muse, music. Get it? It's good though. Once you start feeling like a little anxious, like, okay, that's what I want. Yeah. We were warming up and I wasn't feeling anything. I was numb. But when we started, it didn't feel like a sauna in here. <laughs> yeah. I put 100 pounds in this lift in three sessions, or four sessions. Right. 700, no, three sessions. 700, 785, 800. Three sessions, one week, 100 pounds. Right. People say, how's that possible? It's like when you, it, it, you figured out the lift, but when you figured it out, you're getting weaker. Exactly. <laughs> I'm getting weaker because I'm getting better at this lift and yeah. not doing anything else that will actually make me stronger. Right. This is not making me stronger. Well. It's probably breaking me down. How many more weeks of it do you have? Cool. Well, I want to hit 900 with this. Okay. 100 wanna, away. I want to call Guinness world record and set an absolutely useless record. I'd love for them just to come in here and hang out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>
Okay, seated deadlifts. <laughs> Next lift. All right, I'm gonna max out on it. Yeah. Yeah, let's go.